Hello, Chamber membership. My name is Kim Markham and have the pleasure this year of serving as your chairman of the Ashmore Randolph Chamber of Commerce. What I'd like to do here over the next, I'm going to try to do it in about four minutes, is give you a quick update um, at our half year mark on uh, successes that we've had so far this year. And um, first of all, I'd like to say from our retreat last year, we put an action plan together. And uh, what I'd like to do is just give you a quick update. I'd like to start out with internal affairs, which includes membership, ambassadors club, Christmas parade, and no tie fair. I can tell you that our, our ambassadors and our membership are working very closely together. They um, actually, uh, ambassadors actually go out and uh, deliver our plaques to our, our new members. Uh, membership presently right now is looking at having a uh, kind of a membership, I'll call it a blitz, uh, or membership drive. And uh, more on that will be coming up here over the next next few weeks. Uh, also implemented a six month personal follow up for our new members. Uh, the no tie fair was a great success. I'd like to thank uh, JB Davis and Claire again for letting us use their facility. And then the Christmas parade committee has started meeting, uh, which is just around the corner. I won't be long on that. Under community development, that's uh, business and education, leadership Randolph, student lift, our downtown development, and special events. Uh, it's real neat seeing our business leaders and our educators working very closely together. Uh, they had a uh, school supply drive, and I think it's about 1,500 items came in on that. Presently, we're working on updating the Get a Life DVD and they're continuing to work on uh, literacy, interpersonal skills, which includes financial and having a reading day. Um, Leadership Randolph is uh, going well. I um, had the opportunity to be in that this year, and we've got, uh, I think, business and industry coming up actually in August on that, so that's going, going very well. We've also completed the student lift graduation and uh, lots of planning for downtown development. Successes there so far this year, the, uh, the bicycle or the bike criterium. We had also Art Mayhem and then our cruise in. In fact, uh, we've got cruise in coming up the fourth Saturday of each month, I believe through October. And then special events. Um, actually, special events got together and wanted to have a new event this year. Uh, we did a rank voting and we decided to have a speaker come in and thanks to Energizer, we were able to get John O'Leary, who is in the Energizer Hall of Fame, and uh, that was a great success. Under business and industry, which includes marketing technology, business showcase, and seminars and workshop, we've uh, just implemented, or if you go to our website, you'll see the, the member spotlight video. You know, please take advantage of that. Here's a good, good way for you to advertise your business or your services uh, to probably, I'd say, over 1,200 people. So, uh, and it's free. Business Showcase, working very hard. Uh, showcase coming up here in the next couple months. And uh, they've changed it this year. The times are going to be from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. And a lot of neat things going on with that. Also, uh, seminars and workshop work very hard in developing what we call a Chamber 101. And basically, it was a session for our new members and existing members to come out and learn more about what the Chamber has to offer and uh, great success with that. Also working very close with SCORE and um, well, also this was neat and this came from the retreat also but webinars we uh, created a partnership with the business training team and if you go to our website you'll see uh, Ashbury Randolph Chamber Business Institute. Click on that and look at the webinars that are available. Under governmental affairs, we did uh, put together our legislative agenda and sent that proposal in and was uh, able to review that with our board of directors. Again, um, the governmental was involved in the Chamber 101 as far as uh, raising awareness to government issues. And then this is real neat. The uh, governmental affairs worked very close with the city and the city has added now to their website uh, in a business category of how to start a business to help accelerate the steps of starting a business as far as rules and regulations and possibly zoning. Then they also completed two lunch series this year. We had John from ICA come in who is a ex-Disney employee, dynamic speaker, and then also the North Carolina Live. 
so that's just a quick update. Um, just want to thank everybody again. You know, the success of our chamber would not happen if it was not from our volunteers and from our membership. So really appreciate it. Also like to take this time to thank our staff at the chamber. You know, it's a staff of three, and then we have Nancy working there also. But uh, everybody does a great job and just appreciate everybody's commitment. Also like to thank the employers for allowing your employees to, to, to participate in the, uh, in the chamber committees and activities. Thank you.